Hi everyone! You know October's over. I'm really excited about Christmas, the Vlogmas series. Can you tell? Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. I'm always super excited, super thankful to see you guys. So thank you so much for taking a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. So thank you so much from the bottom of my heart and welcome. This is just a really quick informal series. It's coffee, tea, wine, and life today. It's coffee. It's cold outside. It's about 38 degrees now. The wind is howling. We have like, Alexa has been going off about wind chills and wind speeds and who knows what. So cheers, everyone. Hope everyone is having a fantastic weekend. Coffee sometimes hits the spot. Cheers. But it's getting kind of late in the day, so I have switched over to my decaf. So I've just got my Krispy Kreme Classic Decaf Coffee. I don't really like their regular coffee, but I do like their decaf. Not sure what the difference is. Well, one's caffeinated, one's not, right? But other than that, I don't know why they taste different. But anyway, so today I happen to receive my sip and savor my club shipment of the christmas advent calendar ones and do you remember like a few months ago when i found out that they didn't do the one for halloween and then they were still kind of deciding whether they were going to do the christmas advent calendars because they had so many people complain that they don't celebrate christmas they don't celebrate advent why do they have to get that in the club shipment so they were kind of going back and forth whether or not they were going to do that. And that was like in September. So I decided not to take a chance. They did have some already up on their website. So I said, you know what, just so I don't miss it, I'm gonna order one. And I ordered one with the 12 sweaters and I just kind of did it verbally because I was talking to customer service and she said, oh, I'll take care of it for you. And so she sent me this big one here for the 24 bottle one. And they did charge me just the, the price for the $12 one. So I figured that was their way of saying, I'm sorry, I know you were one that really was looking forward to this calendar. We disappointed you with the Halloween and which really turned out okay because then I just, kind of experimented with all different kinds of fun labels. So anyway, my club shipment come, came today and it's the another advent calendar. So I've got one here with 24, one here with the 12, and then I've got the one that I pre-ordered from QVC in July, in the Christmas in July. So I've got another 12 bottle advent calendar coming. I'm gonna be advent calendar wine overload. I'm gonna need help. Does anybody live near me that maybe we can kind of split this up and do like a sharing while we sip or whatever? But anyway, I just kind of wanted to come on real quick and just give everyone a quick reminder. I probably am not going to have too many videos in between now and the 14th. And I just wanted to give a quick reminder about the giveaway, which is this Henny and Lev, this either cognac bag or caramel color tote bag. It is a vegan leather. It is well made. It does have a dust bag. We've got pocket in front. There's two pockets inside and it will be full of some goodies to help keep the shape. So again, I am going to leave that video again posted up here. This just has the, uh, the secret word in there to use and all the rules and regulations or whatever will be in the comments on that one. So anyway, if you do do that, I'll be closing it on the 14th. I believe that's a Monday. So probably sometime during the day when I'm working, I'm going to say, oh, I got to go and close this and then um, go from there and just check everyone that did use the code word before I even do um, the random picking or whatever. I just kind of double check right then to make sure that they are publicly subscribed. So if you just want a quick double check, I know there's some people that constantly enter my giveaways but they're not publicly subscribed to me so if you just want to just quick double check to make sure you are if you entered that way there's no hurt feelings or anything like that so i wanted to get on about that and i really don't have too much going on this week i 
made some soups this weekend so I'm excited about some more soups that I have not made yet um, I made a potato soup which I had made before and this one was a new recipe that I got um, I just kind of did a quick search on the internet and this one looked really good it had cream cheese in it and yeah it was really looks good and some chicken not only chicken broth but also cream of chicken soup it's really smooth it's rich and creamy so i'm looking forward to doing that one it'll either be like a wine wednesday or a wine thir or wine thursday i need to have a wine every day of the week because i'm I gotta get rid of this stuff or on a wine diary on a friday so it'll be one of those and then the other one i made is a mexican meatball soup Oh my god that one smells so good i had that you know them cooking both in the crock pots and between that and the raisin walnut muffin scentsy it was it was it was scent overload it was just the house just really really smelled nice so i'm looking forward to get, getting those done probably on a wednesday and a friday i actually already did my video for friday this friday coming up and it's a battle a battle of the wine so you might want to check that one out it was it was really fun to make and other than that um um i picked a book of the month club so that one should be coming again the things that i normally get like ipsy should be here pretty soon the the ipsy the clam bag the glam bag regular um the look fantastic the glossy box i did end up canceling the boxy charm over that kind of weird one where i got three face masks that they counted as full-size products so we kind of had a disagreement even though i do click in the reviews that i love the sheet mask i really don't think it's fair that they count that as a one mask as a full-size product that's just I think that's just me. I mean, we get those in the Ipsy, uh, you know, the regular bag one as a full-size product, and, and I'm more than happy with that. Or sometimes I even give you two and count that as a product. So I don't know. So I won't be getting that anymore. But I have been getting emails daily from them to sign back up again for a free gift, but we'll kind of wait and just just play it out. And um, that bit fun i haven't got that in a few years but this past week it's been like every day they're sending me an email to get a free gift and whatever but i just haven't done that one again yet i just i don't know we'll, we'll see how it goes maybe next year or something i will try doing that again but i am having fun doing my planner type scrapbook type journal whatever you want to call it so i'm going to put a little video at the end of just the pages that I've done since the last time that we did this. So it'll be like the full month. <coughs> Sorry about that. Let me take a sip of coffee here. So I did a full month of October, which I really had fun with October, not only with dressing up in costume for the videos, but every week in October, I used a kit for halloween so that was really fun september i did some fall based themes and then while i was watching some videos and doing comments or whatever i went through and i picked out some kits that i want to use for november and december so i kind of pre-put them in my book so that later on just to kind of keep it easy kind of keep it flowing and not have to do so much at once you know just when that week goes just you know i got the page already laid out so i'll show you that at the end how i did that but I'll just show you some of the blank pages so you get an idea what I mean when I said that I put some pretty things in here this one's pretty so this was one in December and this one is sparkly and these were all made for my when I was doing the Erin Condren a um, while ago so it's a smaller books and I just bought a lot of kits at and then I just kind of got away from it I, I don't know why I think I was doing it because I wanted to do uh, the plan with me videos that really were not taking off and then I just kind of got discouraged and it was like well I was doing it to do videos but I was doing it because I enjoyed it so that's why I wanted to get back and do it but I've got a ton of kits so this is like a page that I've got pre-set up already so that later on I can just add in some dates um, you know like add in the dates add in like the thumbnails of any videos that I do or 
different appointments, just fun things. And if I don't have something to write that day, I can just kind of do a little bit of journaling for the day that I don't have any pitches to do, or just kind of go back and get some pictures, you know, scan them in and put them in here. So that is really fun. I really enjoy doing that. And it, um, glad that I kind of made that decision that I wasn't really doing this for anybody else but, but me. It just gives me a really nice sense to kind of look back and look at the year and what's been done for videos that I put out or different family moments and the kids growing up and it's just been so much fun. But anyway, I'm just going to sign off uh, for here. I just wanted to pop in real quick, say hi to everyone. I hope you have a great week. And again, to remind everyone about the the giveaway and that'll be on the 14th because I'm not sure just uh, how many videos I'm going to put out between now and then. And I am looking forward to my Vlogmas series for Christmas. I'm probably not going to run into long ones because last year I really wore myself out. It was you know just the talking all day you know at work on the phone and then trying to do a video every night so that was that was really hard it took a lot of strength to do that and I know that sounds stupid that you run out of energy talking but for some reason you do but I'm looking forward to finishing putting away my Halloween stuff and dragging out the boxes with my Christmas stuff from last year right my ugly Christmas sweaters and dresses. I'm not sure what's going to fit, what's not going to fit, but we'll worry about it then. And um, I was thinking this weekend I was almost going to start putting up my Christmas tree because it took me a long time last year to do it because, like I said, I just don't have the energy. And so I'd work on it for about an hour. I'd, you know, put some videos on um, the the big TV. So while I was doing a little bit of decorating, I could watch someone's video and then oh, hit pause and then go and type a comment. And so I may end up doing it early just to get it done. I don't think I'm going to bring up all my nutcrackers this year, but I do have videos of them. So I'll be, you know, putting together that little intro. So I'll be having those nutcrackers in the beginning, but I don't think I'm going to bring them up from downstairs this year. But anyway, so that's about it. I hope you guys go out, have a fabulous week, and um, take care, everyone. Stay safe, be kind, be happy, enjoy life, have some fun. Love you guys so much. We will see you in the next video. Alrighty, so this, I believe, is a page that I last showed you, and it was week from September. 12th through the, the 18th and this one um we just had that that audio book from stephen king 11 it was really a great book to listen to it was 30 hours and 40 minutes long so it took me a while to listen to it while i was working so let's get to the next spread and this one was September 19th through the 25th. And again, I've just got my thumbnails in here and uh, just a few things off to the side. You know, like what hours I worked, what I had to do. This was actually a kit that was um, about wine. I still have quite a few kits from when I was doing this more often. But I like having my thumbnails in here, and it just kind of gives me a little diary of what I did. And then this was the wink that I had posted, wink, my wink box. So I've got uh, Friday had the thumbnail for the video, and then at the bottom I listed all three wines. And this one was September 26th through October 2nd. So again, just a fun fall kit that I had. It was actually Maddie Matt's birthday, so I've got a little item on him. So again, my thumbnails. Just a little bit about what was going on for the week. And Maddie Matt, how he's changed through the years. Happy birthday, Maddie Matt. For October, I used a Halloween-themed kit um, for every week of the month. This one was one on Hocus Pocus, so it was just a really cool, colorful kit. It was also Quinn's birthday, 
He's right there. Tuesday was his birthday, and there's a picture of Rick holding him and Quinn throughout the years. And again, just some thumbnails in this kit, the Hocus Pocus kit from Sugary Gal Shop. This was a really, really fun kit to work with. Lots of colors. And there's a Sabrina and the Jelly Beans picking out their pumpkins. And then just some pictures from the backyard and one of our last fall rides with Rick on his bike. Actually, we went through Anoka, so they have like every storefront is decorated and inside. It's just really a nice place to visit. Alrighty, and this one is week from October 10th through October 16th. And I believe this was a kid I was getting uh, different subscriptions for. Um, planners and things and then I never really got to use them. That's an old thumbnail with my Scentsy table. All the fun Halloween fall Scentsy warmers and costume of course because I like costumes. And just fun looking back at the, the thumbnails and what was posted during the week. And again, if you really have a life and other than me and you've got appointments to keep and things like that, it's a really great place to keep everything. And that's uh, me at the bar. I was tending bar at the time and Rick came in dressed as a gorilla. He was very, very hot. And then just a little tribute. Every October we would go camping up in the White Mountains in New Hampshire. So the White Mountain, the National Forest, always a beautiful trip. And this is October 17th through the 23rd. And again, just another fun Halloween kit. Starting out here with a picture of myself with Raina and Sabrina. We're up at Castle in the Clouds in the White Mountains in New Hampshire. Some more thumbnails. And again, this was just a really fun kit to work with. Picture of Raina and Sabrina. Every year we would always go and visit my mom and dad's house do some trick-or-treating in their neighborhood and the thumbnails and a picture of Rick with the girls that was when we were living in Pawtucket Rhode Island and then for the bottom I just love watching Halloween movies so I just kind of printed different posters that I found online with different Halloween movies. It's just fun. The month of October, too, to so many different channels posted that you could watch a month of movies every day. So that was fun. For the last week in October, this is from the 24th to the 30th. The 31st is actually going to be starting in November, so I'll do that next month. And this one was a kit that was kind of based on Halloween movies. So that was another great one. Remembering like Scream and Nightmare on Elm Street. I forgot what that one was. Was it The Ring or something like that maybe? And there's Tori Pie. She, they're just getting into Stranger Things. So she went as 11. And then the balloon is for it. And Eden, I think that's a minion. I'm not sure. It was like an inflatable costume, and there's a uh, Auntie Raina had posted a video of him walking around the backyard. It was just really cute to watch. And of course, we got Michael Myers here from Halloween. We've got Chucky, and there's Sabrina. She's dressed up as Freddy Krueger. Can't really see her hands, but she does have those the gloves with the finger knives and the tattered sweater and the hat. And again, this one was for the end of the month, posting all four videos for Wink. So I've got the thumbnails at the end. And so that was for the month of October. I thought maybe doing a month at a time might be kind of fun. <laughs>